The term alignment preparation implies that certain conditions are created prior to a coupling being connected. Some general principles apply in all cases of machine installation. Let's overview these. The driven unit is always installed first. The driving unit, or the motor, is next installed and aligned to the driven unit. Before any installation is made, we must first ensure that the machinery foundation is clean and flat. Any high spots or burrs should be dressed down using suitable tools until a perfectly flat and level situation is created. Likewise, ensure that the motor feet or pedestals are clean. Next, carefully position the motor onto its base and install the bolts loosely. Check that the motor does not rock. If it does, then we do not have a solid base. A solid base must first be obtained. To obtain a solid base, first, without tightening the hold down bolts, use a thin feeler gauge around 0.05 mm and check which foot has a gap. Then measure just how much the gap is by trial with various thickness feelers. Having established the gap, obtain or make a shim of corresponding thickness and then fit this shim under the foot. Where side adjusting screws are fitted, ensure that they are in good condition and that they thread in and out without binding. Once a solid base has been achieved on the motor, then Assuming the driven unit is suitably and securely mounted, we can proceed with actual alignment between the two members. Methods of alignment vary, but in all methods we strive for the highest degree of accuracy, whether you're using state-of-the-art laser alignment equipment or just the good old straight edge and feeler gauge method. In the following programs, we shall attempt to show you how effective alignment can be accomplished using traditional methods and standard measuring equipment.